Hey guys, welcome back to The Monet Show. I am Monet and today I'm going to be showing you how to create skincare labels for your products. So, let's begin. your container, your tape measure, and paper and pen to record your measurements. All right, so the first thing that I like to do is to measure the width of my container. All right, so this container seems as if, seem as if it's gonna be uh, 6.5 or six. So I think I'm gonna settle for the 6.5. I'm gonna move on and I'm gonna measure the height of my container, which is one inch. So that's a 6.5 by one inch. The last thing that I do is to write this down because, you know, sometimes we can forget things. So I'm going to write it down and I'm going to put 6.5 or 6.5 inches. And as for my height, I'm going to put 1 inches just so that I can have that whenever I need it. Now we're going to move on to the more technical side of creating your labels. So I like using Canva because it is a really great designing software. It's really basic and they have the free as well as the paid option. I use the paid because there's more stuff that come with it. Please follow the red arrow because this is what I'll be using to show, to show you what to do. Alright, so we're going to click on create a design and the next thing that you want to do is click on custom dimensions now you remember when we wrote our measurements down you're going to need it now so i'm going to put it in inches and i'm going to put 6.5 by one from there canva will create the template for your label for you to work with now, if you want to maximize your workspace, you can choose the percentage at the bottom of the screen and you can choose to maximize or decrease your workspace. Now, moving on, the first thing that I like to do is to divide my label just so that I have three areas working with. All right, so I like choosing lines and as you can see, I'm going to be changing the color of my lines to black. All right. And when I divide my labels in three, it basically is giving me the front side of my label and then the two sides. Now that I have my three sections to work with, the next thing that I do is to add the words. And this is going to be a very simple, basic label. But um, the first thing that I do is to add the name of my business, plans for skin, and then I'll minimize that and put it at the top of the label. Since I like this font, I'm just going to duplicate it and use it for the rest of the words on my labels. And now the next thing that you want to do is to put the name of your product, which is basically just a body butter. Also, most importantly, ensure that you're putting the size or the quantity of your product. So in this case, it was a two ounce jar. So I'll just put two ounce on the container. So moving right along, I'm going to put the ingredients in the body butter and I'm also going to put the instructions slash how to use the product. Also, you can choose not to or if you want to, I'm not sure it's up to you, but you can put the PO box of your company. I know that you do need to put an address just in case your customers may have an issue and they need to reach out. You can put your address as well as the number of your company. Also, even though this is a basic label, this is not a label that I would use for my business per se, but this label basically has everything that your label needs to have by law. Your label should have the name of your business, the name of the product, the instructions, the ingredients, the address, and the number of your business. All right, as well as the size and quantity of your product. Please ensure that you guys have this just to ensure that you are obeying the law.
Moving on, if you want to add just a cute picture to your labels, you can go back to elements and I'm just gonna go with this little cute heart right here and I'm gonna put it in the how to use section. I think it's really cute. So that is just to show you guys how to add pictures to your labels. Also, just remember to properly save your, your file. All you have to do is click the file button on top and then I'm just gonna change it to body butter label, <laughs> body butter label and yeah. Then just save your design to your device. Now on to the fun part of getting your labels printed. I use Sticker Meal. Um, they have different options and you can choose the labels part. Now the labels that they have, they have a variety of different sizes of different shapes and i think it's really fun i really love sticker meal but i'm just going to go with the regular rectangular shape that they have now as you can see they have their own sizes but you also have the option of customizing your own size and remember what we did which was 6.5 for the width and then one for the height all right now after you've inputted all your information for your measurements, now it's time for you to upload your design. Once you've uploaded it, then it's time for you to check out and then pay for your labels. Also, their labels are waterproof. And that's it. Just click check out and your labels will be ready and on the way. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if this video was helpful and remember to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Thank you guys and have a great week.